Welcome! Today we'll provide a step-by-step -step walkthrough on securing your drive using Seagate Toolkit. Ensuring your data is safe and protected is important and will guide you through the essential steps. Before we begin, it's important to note how specific Seagate models self-encrypt your data and work seamlessly with Seagate Toolkit's secure application for added protection. Toolkit makes it easy to maximize your storage solution. It offers user-friendly tools for tasks like file backup and security management. Use Toolkit to secure your data by setting a password and benefit from advanced AES-256 bit encryption technology. To begin, go to Seagate.com and choose the support button. Scroll down and click Software Downloads. Under Popular Downloads for Windows, choose Toolkit. The Toolkit User Guide can be accessed after choosing View Support Information. This guide offers clear instructions and valuable insights to help you make the most of the software. To start with the installation, Click on the Download for Windows button. Navigate to your Downloads folder in the File Explorer. Launch the application by clicking on the seagatetoolkit.exe file. You have multiple options to open the toolkit. Double-click the toolkit icon on your desktop, type Toolkit in the Search Windows bar, and select the app or click on the Start menu and select Toolkit from the menu. To start enabling security with Toolkit, ensure your drive is connected to a Windows computer. Next, open Toolkit. Click on the Seagate Secure on the main menu and choose Setup. Enter the 8-character secure code SID from the insert included in your device packaging. Keep in mind that the secure code is case-sensitive, differentiating between upper and lowercase letters. Click Next to proceed. Set a password to unlock the drive on any computer. In the top field, enter a memorable yet hard-to-guess password. Remember, the password is case-sensitive. Confirm by entering the same password in the lower field, then click Next. Creating a password hint is optional. If you forget your password, having a hint can assist in remembering it. This time, Generate a password reset key as a precaution in case you forget your password. This adds an additional layer of security to your Seagate drive. You can either set it up later or do it during setup. For now, let's proceed with setup. Please log in to your Seagate account. If you do not have one yet, click on Create Account if this is your first step. Once your password is successfully set up, you'll see the message Setup Complete. Utilize the toolkit to manage Seagate Secure, which includes the option to add another user through the multi-user feature. Click Done to proceed to the next step. After completing the setup process, you'll be directed back to the main menu. To secure your data, the drive locks itself automatically whenever it's unplugged from the computer. Each time you connect your drive to a computer with Toolkit installed, you'll be prompted to enter your password. For added security, you can manually lock the drive even while it's connected to your computer. Next, in the Seagate Toolkit application, 
Click on the Seagate Secure on the main menu. Click the lock button within the Seagate Secure screen. Enter your password in the provided dialog box and click lock to confirm. Also, you will see a checkbox for Trust This Computer. If you enable this option, you can lock and unlock the drive on this computer without entering a password. However, you will still be required to enter a password if you connect the drive to a different computer that was not enabled to be trusted. Now that you've successfully locked the drive, you will have the option to unlock it. Unlocking the device is as simple as clicking the button located at the upper left corner. Click Unlock and a prompt to open the drive will appear. If you wish to modify your password, you have the option to do so in the menu. Click on Change Password, then click Next to proceed. On the screen, you'll be prompted to enter your current password, followed by your new password and confirm it. Please take note that the password hint is an option. Click Next to proceed. Following the steps earlier, as displayed on the screen, the password has been successfully changed. Enabling multi-user access allows you to provide a second user with secure access to the drive and this user can have a separate, unique password. To disable security features with your Seagate drive, simply select it from the menu options. You'll be then prompted to enter your password with the username automatically populated for your convenience. Once you've entered the password, proceed by clicking on Continue. After completing the steps, you'll receive a prompt stating, Security has not been enabled. To re-enable security, choose the option Enable Security, then enter the password you created when you first enabled security. Upon clicking Continue, you'll regain access to the same features as before. If in case you need password assistance, you can use the online user guide in the description box. Important! Seagate can't recover a forgotten password for your drive, but here's a way to be prepared. When you first set up your drive, you can create a password reset key. This key will allow you to reset your password yourself if you ever forget it. Creating a reset key is highly recommended. Initiating a factory reset on the drive leads to the complete deletion of all data and the removal of all security settings including your password. This action effectively restores the drive to its original factory settings. From the main menu, click on Factory Reset. A notification will appear indicating that the action will erase all data on the drive and remove your security settings. Confirm your intention by clicking Reset. You will be prompted to enter your PSID 32 character reset code, which is listed on the insert included in your device packaging. Enter the PSID, noting that the toolkit automatically converts lowercase letters to uppercase. Click Next to proceed. You'll receive an on screen prompt confirming that the factory settings are complete. Simply click OK to return to the main menu. For more details, Seagate website links can be found in the description below.